If I'm president, I will wake up every day and remind Americans that not only must we do better, but also that we can do better. Because I believe in America. President Obama boasts that he will fundamentally transform America. I want to restore America to our founding principles. I believe that our founding principles are what made America the greatest nation in the history of the earth. Now, among those core principles is what the founders called the pursuit of happiness. We call that opportunity, or the freedom to choose our course in life. That principle is the foundation of a society that is based on ability, not birthright. In a merit-based society, people achieve their dreams through hard work and education, risk-taking, and even a little luck. An opportunity society produces pioneers and inventors. It inspires its citizens to build and create. And these people exert effort and take risks. And when they do so, they employ and lift others and create prosperity. Their success does not make others poorer. It makes all of us better off. President Obama sees America differently. He believes in an entitlement society. Once we thought that entitlement meant that Americans were entitled to the privilege of trying to succeed in the greatest nation in the world. Americans fought and died to earn and protect that entitlement. But today, the new entitlement battlefield of this president is over the size of the check you can get from Washington. President Obama has reversed John Kennedy's call for sacrifice. He would have Americans now ask, what can the country do for you? <laughs> Just a couple of weeks ago, in Kansas, President Obama lectured us about Teddy Roosevelt's philosophy of government. But he failed to mention the important difference between Teddy Roosevelt and himself. Roosevelt believed that government should level the playing field to create equal opportunities. President Obama believes that government should create equal outcomes. In an entitlement society, Everyone receives the same or similar rewards, regardless of education, effort, and willingness to take risk. That which is earned by some is redistributed to others. And the only people who truly enjoy real rewards are those who get to do the redistributing. Government. The truth is that everyone may get the same rewards under that kind of system, but virtually everyone will be worse off. President Obama's entitlement society would demand a massive growth of government. To preserve opportunity, however, we have to shrink government, not grow it. 